Hello, this is a UK review, rough and ready review of the uh, brand new Belkin 3-in-1 uh, MagSafe fast wireless charger that I've had for two weeks now. And uh, the reason why you see two chargers in the picture is because I already have a, had this particular charger, which I bought from a well-known online uh, shopping website, which cost me £30, and it's also a 3-in-1 charger. So for example, you can put your AirPods on, you can put your Apple Watch on, and you can put your iPhone on, and it, and it seems to work pretty well. And I've been very happy with it. It's even got a little fan uh, behind to keep things cool. This uh, charges at, they said, 10 watts, uh, the phone, which is pretty good. But the reason why I decided to get something new is because this seems to stop charging the iPhone after about one hour, two hours. So I've often woken up in the morning, my phone's not charged. And I don't know whether it's because it's an Apple software thing or whether it's because my phone's in a case. It's on a MagSafe case. I don't know whether that's been uh, affecting it, uh, charging. So I was looking for something new. But with that being £30, this Belkin one is a staggering £140. I'm sure like a lot of you, you've been at home uh, for most of the year. So I've not spent hardly any money this year. So I thought I'd treat myself and try this. Uh, but again, I'm kind of bulk at paying £140. But I have to say it looks nice. And I just wanted to see what the quality is like. Um, so I've been, like I said, I've been using it for about two weeks now. Um, it comes in a, a white or black finish. I decided to go... Uh, for the white finish for the base. It weighs about 520 grams or so and it's got a nice non-slip surface and you can see where the power cable plugs in there uh, at the base. But once it's on the desk it feels nice and secure. And then this is the plug that goes with it. It's a nice moulded plug. I'm going to pl plug that in now. The, uh, the cable that comes with it, with the plug, is around 1.4, say, 1.4 metres long. So just so you know that you have, or how far you need your plug socket. Mine's right next to the bed, which is what I'm doing uh, the review. Uh, the base is about 13.5 centimetres wide, and the whole thing sits about 13.5 centimetres tall. But measured from there to there, it's about 16.5 centimetres wide. Uh, and these are standard sized uh, MagSafe plates for the and uh, for the phone and uh, Apple Watch charger. And it's worth noting that these are fixed in place. You cannot move and change the angle. Uh, so it's just like a, a T shape, and that's how it is. That's how it stays. And then, of course, you can put your things on. Move that one out of the way. You can put place your watch so and again a little bit disappointed because again this thing still wobbles about all over the place but obviously holds your uh, apple watch in place and then the my iphone 12 pro max and that's quite embarrassing but normally there we go so once it's on it's on and it's absolutely fine and you get the nice little um illustration of of how far it's charged and the main thing selling point with this is once it's on as you saw it goes on much easily I don't know why I got it wrong the first time but you can kind of do it uh, horizontally as well uh, and that's so you can watch a film and I've already done that so it comes in quite handy um, but that's the thing uh, and this I have to say they say fast wireless charging but it's just 15 watts and to be honest a lot of other manufacturers charge their things a lot faster than Apple, but that's fast enough because it's a bedside charger and it is something to charge my things so they're ready to go in the morning and that's more than fast enough. So overall, I'm happy with it, but it's, a, like I said, a staggering £140. Uh, this other one here, <laughs> £30. <laughs> um, from, from that point of view, it's certainly not really worth it. If, if I was to see that in a shop, I'd probably pay around £60, £50, £60, but Will I keep it? I would say so, because it, it does the job and it looks uh, very nice. Um, so, yeah, I, I think I'm going to keep it for now. But uh, if you found this uh, review useful, then please give me a thumbs up. Thanks.